there, buddy. Listen, if you're trying to get a property under contract, your real estate wholesaler, for pity's sake, don't text the seller. Hey, I heard my offer. Like you're you're asking to lose, right? I mean, you how, people sell homes based on emotion. Okay, they they just do. When you're texting somebody, you know this. You should know this. You you can't. I mean, even right now, I'm, I'm raising my voice. I'm animated. That kind of thing. You see, I'm being passionate as I'm talking to you. I'm not talking like this. When you get a property under contract, make sure you get the prop. You know, a, a house on the. Uh, don't do it via texting, right? I'm not. Uh, you you see my point? Texting, you can't do that. So where am I going with this? You got to make it emotional. When you want to get a property under contract, for pity's sake, get on the phone with them, talk with them, get on a Zoom call. It's 20, 23, almost twenty four. For pity's sake, do a Zoom call, get them, get them excited about it for a why they're selling, right? And get them to contract so, and to solve their problem. It's not about texting. If all you got is trying to text somebody, you're, you're going to, you're just wasting your time. You're wasting their time because all they're going to do is look at their text and go, nah, not interested. Did you make any money? Did you make 20 grand? No, you didn't. Okay. Don't text these. I mean, they're all with texting. I text people all the time. My wife and I. But look. When it, when it comes to getting the property in the contract, for pity's sake, pick up the phone and call them. Or better yet, if you have never done a deal before, you don't understand comps and rehab costs and things, you'd be wise to actually get your ass in your car and drive down there to, to meet the, the, the seller and talk with them. See what kind of repairs there is. Because the buyer's going to ask you, right? And you could say, well, I, the seller told me this, the seller told me that. To your, to your buyer, all right? You could. Well, how much more professional is it to say, hey, hey, Mr. Buyer, yeah, Mr. Buyer, I, I've been all through the house. Here's some great photos of it. It's kind of what it's going to look like. It's what I need. Probably cost you 50 grand in rehab, 45, 50 kind of thing, your net ROI after you know, commissions and things, but, you know, maybe about 60 grand, right? Sounds a lot more professional, right? So my point is this. Don't text the seller if you're trying to do a contract. You can say, hey, I'm running five minutes late, to, you know, whatever. That's fine. But when it's coming to the contract, make it emotional. I hope this helps. Do, do yourself a favor. If you want to get a property in a contract, talk to the seller in person, either or over the phone or Zoom. Okay, so I hope this helps. If you need help, clarification, maybe what to offer a, a seller, that kind of thing, just let me know below. We'll get on a Zoom call, and potentially I can help you, and we can do some uh, joint venture together. Godspeed. See you in the next video.